Number seven, Utah. Give me a break. <laughs> at Florida, Utah yeah. favored by three in the swamp. Over under 51 and a half total points. Game kicks off at 7 o'clock Eastern, 6 o'clock Central on ESPN. Yeah. Who you like in the game? Well, I tell you who I don't, man, and that is Utah. <laughs> 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 this thing's gone around back and forth, and, and, you know, they've been cute with the quarterback, and they've been cute with the records the last 10 years. Who gives a shit? All that <laughs> does not matter, Mike. It does not matter. Yeah. And the fa- I was joking, you know, this thing's flip-flop the points, and, and nothing against Florida, but the fact that this is a three-point game, should tell you that Utah should not be a top 25 program. If that was the case, then Florida should be a top 25 program. And I think they're close. I think they're on the edge. But they still got a lot to prove. And Utah has proved nothing to me. What, yeah. making it through the pack? Get out of here, Mike. Get out of here with that. No. There's a reason most of those athletes are trying to get to the SEC so they can get to the next level. So, yeah. I, 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 I'm just not a fan of Utah. They don't know what they're walking into. And this is big for the fans. Who shows up in Gainesville? How loud is the swamp? Because I've been down there when it's been mean and ugly, and I want to trade. I want to buy a Florida Gator shirt so I don't have. To, I don't get spit on <laughs> on my way out. You know, that's the kind of violence I need to see, and I'm not. I'm not. I'm not promoting that. I don't want to see any spitting. But, <laughs> but you know, make Swamp a dangerous place to play. You do that, then you rattle Utah. Utah has never been into an atmosphere like, like Gainesville, man. Mm-hmm. And, it, and as hot and humid as it is, they really could take advantage of that. And that's what I hope happens here. And that's why I got Florida winning, because home field advantage matters in the SEC. So give me Florida – Give me da, 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 where are we at? It's not a big one, but I got uh, it wasn't Honda dealership, but I went Florida twenty eight, Utah twenty one. Ooh, yeah. I, I don't know if you heard this, Shane, but the, apparently Utah and their practice facility, yeah. they've been pumping in humidity to match what it's going to be in the swamp. Yeah, that. good luck with that, brother. You know, there's just no mimicking that. Uh, <laughs> it is funny you say those stats are BS because I do. I got one of these for you. Utah thirteen and two in their last 15 season openers so I mean they know how to get this team fired up for yeah. the openers they bring back a ton on offense I think people are getting mystified because they they seemingly went toe-to-toe with Ohio State last year yeah. in the bowl game so everyone's falling in love hell even in that game they lost a damn ball game yet we're sitting here hyping them up as a playoff contender I don't think they got any idea what's coming for them Mm-mm. with Anthony Richardson and this Billy Napier uh, offensive attack, Shane. I think the Gators are, are going to be a lot more physical than Utah. Utah's yeah. build is the physical team in the Pac-12. Yeah. Well, they're going to find out what that's worth in the SEC <laughs> and that heat and humidity. Yeah. So, yeah, like you said, I mean, the crowd is, is just going to be an X factor. Yeah. If Utah can come out and jump, somehow get to a big lead and quiet the crowd, that's going to be their recipe for winning this football game. Mm-hmm. But I just – I don't th- – I think it's going to be a four-quarter game. Yeah. Could go either way. But I'm right there with you. I got Florida 24, Utah 21. All right, last game.